Sandy? Yes. Hi, it's Teresa. How are you? Okay. Good. Is it okay if I work with you live? Yes. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> I feel like I have a frog in my throat now. <clears throat> so I have a motherly... <clears throat> now I can't talk. I have a motherly energy coming to my awareness when I say my mom, grandma, aunt, or mother-in-law. Okay. She makes me feel like kidney renal issues. And I also feel... I feel it more on the left side. It could be both, but I feel it more on the left. And she also makes you feel like fluid in the lungs or difficulty breathing. Does that resonate with you? Yes. <clears throat> and then the game Uno, there's a, a strong connection with that, that the Uno game. Yes. Every Sunday she, when my mom was sick, my grandma would come out. And that's who, who I think you have is my grandma. Oh, she it, would come out and we play Uno okay. every Sunday. And she was really good at it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh yeah. If she would win, she'd be like, see, I'm better than you guys. Oh. And then is this the same grandma with the um, the kidney issues? Yes. Okay. Then this would be her coming through. She's making reference to the three girls. Would, would you understand that, Sandy? Yes. Yes. Okay. Out of the three, two are similar. One is different. Yes. Okay. <laughs> And I'm also feeling, was there, there's a conversation around breast cancer or there's a breast cancer connection? Not that I know of, not uh, breast cancer. I'll leave that there with you, okay? I feel like it's, if I had one shot and I could be absolutely wrong and you could absolutely 100% tell me no, but I feel like somebody was in a conversation about breast cancer or getting the girls checked, breast cancer. I have an appointment in January. I just made my appointment yesterday. Oh, okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Um, I'm not saying that you have it. That's not what I'm saying, but she's just getting me there. Right. Okay. So you were just having right. that Well, you just made the appointment. So again, this is how I know that I'm with you and this is your lovey coming through and hi, <laughs> they know what's going on. <laughs> Okay. And is this the same grandma where you have, I think this is an apron she's showing me. I have one. Of, yes, I have one of hers. One of her aprons. Oh, man, I wish I had my grandma's. <laughs> so you would understand it's that. It's real old. Right? Yes. It's the one with the lace or the lace that's falling off, falling apart. Yes. Okay. As long as you understand. Um, cause she's yes. only, and is this the same apron with the color? It has like a blue in it or a blue color? It ha yes. Okay. Then, then, then this is your grandma coming through. <laughs> it was hers. And then she, I don't know the old time, but I guess when a person gets married, they used to put an apron on them. And uh -huh. this was her apron and she put it on my mom. Oh, I love that. I love that. Okay, it's, it's and it's I still have it. Fabulous. Is is okay? Is mom one of those three girls? I don't know. She mom is. There was two of them, and then there was three of us granddaughters. Okay, three. Okay, three, and then out of the three, two are similar. One is different. Yep. Okay, but she makes me feel like she's with she's with another motherly energy. So there's a, there's a mom that's passed. Yes. That would be your mom. Yes. Okay, she's bringing your mom to my awareness. And I'm also feeling like something head-related or Alzheimer's dementia or there's something connected with the head. Mm. Not that I know of. Remember I'm saying that. I'll leave that there with you, okay? Again, know who they could be with that they're bringing to my awareness. There's something head, like stroke, aneurysm. There's... I feel like neurological. Mm, not that I'm, that's coming to mind. Wait, hold on, hold on a second. I think I'm being corrected. Mm. Um, there's a gentleman coming to my awareness. But there was like a tragic, like head trauma or head related injury. My dad had um, a stroke. On oh, it, yes, it could be my dad's brother. Okay, I feel like head trauma or head related. Okay, hang on one second. Your father's passed. Correct. Remember, I said there's something head related, like stroke or aneurysm. So we have that. Yes. I'm also feeling like head trauma 
but I feel like it would be like something would be inflicted from the outside. So there's that connection yes. as well. Know how your grandma is bringing your love, your loved ones to my awareness for you. So your, okay. your, your grandma's coming through, the father energy is coming through, the mother energy is coming through, and then the, the head, the trauma head, that connection is coming through too as well. Does that resonate with you? Yes. Yes. Okay. So they're all here. <laughs> <laughs> it's a party. <laughs> well, it always is. It always is. <laughs> and I also know my friend, um, April or the fourth of any month, birthday anniversary or passing is important. And I don't want to get stuck on names or dates or anything like that. Just remember April or the fourth because April is the fourth month. So it's the fourth of okay. any month or the month of April. All right. And, um, with your mom, as your mom is coming to my awareness, she makes me feel she's wiping my hands. So when she wipes my hands, it's not for you to take on. I wish I could have done something better or should have done something better or different. Does that resonate with you? Oh, yeah. So in other words, she doesn't want you to hold that that guilt or that shame. I, I, you know, that you're. She makes me feel like you feel like you're not good enough and you're more than worthy. You're more than good enough. Does that resonate with you? Yeah. Okay. And then she's also showing me Band-Aids. Band-Aids. So did you just do something with Band-Aids? I just put them away. Fabulous. <laughs> took them out. We've got a little container and I just took them out of the box and put them in the container. Oh, I love that for you. How beautiful. How beautiful. And there's nothing better than, than uh, old-fashioned apple pie. And I feel like it's homemade. <laughs> yes. <laughs> 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 you know, somebody made a, a. I was just starting. I was just starting to get the ingredients for the apple pie because I make a big apple pie slice for Thanksgiving. Oh, I love that. Well, we're coming to your house for Thanksgiving. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. There's kidding. plenty of pie. We do ten no. pies. So you, hey. Yeah. You know what? I think it's going to be a quiet Thanksgiving at the uh, at the Rose residence. It's just going to be me and Livy. Me and Livy. Um, and somebody made a, a funny comment. It said, getting crowded up in there. <laughs> I love that. I love you guys. <laughs> so, homemade. Oh, making me hungry. And you know what? I'm not like an apple pie kind of person, to be honest. But the way they make me feel, I could actually like smell it and taste it. And it's like, now I want it. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Mine's good. <laughs> Yours is good. Um, and you put like, a, like an icing on top of yours or like a I yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Oh, so yummy. So yummy. And um, there's like, I'm not sure what this is. Um, I'm not sure if this is like granola, but there's chocolate chunks in it or chocolate pieces in it. Mm, I'm not sure. I feel like there's chocolate in it or chocolate chips or chocolate chunks. I do a trail mix for the kids all the time with um, chocolate in it and okay. peanuts and okay. Okay. all That's, kinds of good stuff. Well, this this year, whenever you're going to make it, were you actually thinking about dark chocolate? Because I'm being shown dark chocolate. Actually, it was talked about. Okay. That's because me. everybody's uh, diabetic or diet history now. Okay. Dark chocolate it is. <laughs> All right, my friend. And then um, I'm also being shown. Oh, did you recently have a bird hit your window? I didn't know. Wait, hold on. I think she's correcting me. Is there a peacock? That's her. <laughs> That's her. <laughs> I love yeah, it. That's her. Me. I love it. There's a is there a peacock connection? Not that I you know with the pretty feathers. Remember. I yeah. Feel, to be honest, I feel like it's in your home. Not a live one. <laughs> it could be a picture. I don't I don't think I have one. Remember I'm saying that, okay? And I feel like it's by okay. the window. The peacock could be I'm like a picture. Look at all my windows. <laughs> the, the peacock could be on something, but I feel like it's by the window. So know how your loved ones are coming through, and you may not know this. It, it could be another family member, but I'll leave that there with you, okay? Okay. And then also sharing the same birthday but years apart. 
That's so, my dad. Okay. Has the same birthday as someone years apart. That's fine. Again, know how they're coming through. Remember that peacock. <laughs> I'm going to look for the peacock now. I know, <laughs> I'm going right? to have to ask. It'll, I'll it'll ask come. everybody. Yeah, don't, don't rack your, your head with your brain with it. Just It'll come to you, and you'll be like, oh, now I get it. And it could be days or weeks later even. <laughs> All right, my friend, do you have any questions? You kind of answer because I was going to ask if they were all together, and it, I think they are. Absolutely, they are. Always, always. And that's, again, another great question. Are they okay? Are they together? You bet, yeah. You bet. That's what, that's what got me through losing my dad was knowing he was going to be with my mom because she's been gone since I was 20. Wow. And my dad has been gone the last um, couple years. It's been two years. And that was what got me through it, knowing that he was going to be with her Ab again. Absolutely. I'm hearing what sounds like Steve. Yeah. I or, know. Yeah. You know Steve? Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. As long as you understand. Yes, they are all together. Sure. Can I ask one question? And For I know sure. it's going to go towards my dad. For sure. Does he approve of what I'm doing? You know, that's another great question. Your loved ones will come through and they want to love you and support you and guide you. And if you're, if you're asking if he's disappointed in you, absolutely not. He's not disappointed in you. And you, Good. and you, and you have to do what's best for you too as well. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That, that makes me feel better. Okay. And also I want to say too is, um, you know, sometimes we, we make decisions on like what we think they, they would want. And it actually comes back to what would be best for you. Yes. So he makes me feel what would be best for you. And you have that old charm. He had given you an old charm or given yes. you a charm. It's it maybe older now. Yes. Backing up what I'm just saying, my friend. I just looked at it today. Fabulous. Again, backing up what I'm just saying. Mm, thank you so much. I needed that. You are so welcome. So welcome. We want that recipe. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime. You know, and make a big old pie for you. <laughs> and, and the thing is, is it's um when you do those things. You know, and holidays, and and those could be hard. You know, they're, you, you know, your loved ones are with you, and they're not physically here. But when you're doing those things, they're right there with you. So know that when you're making that apple pie. <laughs> I will. I I can hear my dad. Yeah, my dad's was always the coffee. Coffee. You have enough coffee on there? Yeah. You got coffee on? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is is that the Folgers coffee? He used to drink Folgers all the time. Okay. All the time. Because you said coffee, he said Folgers. <laughs> yeah. Strong, true. though. He liked it strong. But, yes, he did. He liked it yes, strong. Yes. I put a little extra. And he could drink it all day, all night. Put a little extra in there, he said, make it strong. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he's the character. He was. And it's his birthday. It is Friday. Oh. And my mom's was just last week. Wow. Wow. Well, guess what? Here they are. They're coming through for you. So if thank you, you so much. If you needed a chin up, here it is. I got it. Yep. Got I it. needed it. Thank you. You're welcome. I leave their love with you, my friend. Okay. Thank you again, Teresa. You're so welcome. Take care. You, you too. Bye. Bye, Bye. All right, guys, let's send her lots of love, please. Please. And thank you.